Okay, I'm back from my little break, and I'm going to continue with <coughs> the tutorial, and I'll be linking my map to the world that I made last time. Gek. So we open Fallout 3 and scroll down. YouTube house, there it is, set as active file. Okay. Not responding, yeah. Should have known about tapping hands all the time, I forget. So I'm gonna have a jelly bean. There's only disgusting flavours left. Hey. So what we're gonna do is, is what are we gonna do? We're going to go to the wasteland section of the cell view and we're I'll wait for that to load. Now what I'm gonna do is consult my official strategy guide that doesn't actually bear much resemblance to what the world is really like and find somewhere suitable to put my map. Northern mountains? No, we want to go for the middle. One, two, three, four, five, zone five. There you go. So, okay. We put it by Agatha's house. It sounds like if we put it by Agatha's house, I've got to just look at the map. So, put it by. Let's go for minus 10. And Y can be. What was I just looking at? I can't remember. Oh yes, minus o oh, three. Let's put it there. Yes to all for a little error message here. Wow, it's taking its time to load. Oh, right, we're pretty close to true seat station. I suppose you want it to be close to somewhere where you can just travel to, don't you? Because otherwise, you don't want to be even wandering around for ages trying to find your shack. Here's a nice piece of flat looking ground. So I'm going to go to all down here. Wow, it's being freezing today. And look up. Shack. That looks alright. Um, I have in the past used a better one than that. But I don't know where that is. Really like to see if there's one that actually bears any long and thin, just like our shack. But we enter through the wrong way, so that's not any good. Yeah, let's just go for this first on wood shack at one. So I'm gonna click and drag that into the world. Hit F to drop it to the floor. It goes inside the ground a little bit. I think we'll live with it being slightly on the ground. Hold the Z and lower it down on the ground. Yeah, it's clipped into the ground, but all that means is somebody just put loads and loads of effort into building it. But if they sunk it into the ground. Was this for the door we used for the inside? No, it was not. This is a bus door. If I'd read it, I would have known what it was. Nope. Was that it? This wasn't it, it was for cam, but it was used for vaults, isn't it? Well, yes, that's it. I was going to suggest if you could remember what it was just to do it without me showing you, but there we go, click back onto that because we took that off before. Floor it. Match it up as best you can. I'm gonna be 
fairly quick about my up matching because I probably won't use this in my actual game, but it's just a sort of a demonstration really. F to drop it to the floor. There's a bit of a gap there, but it'll be okay. So now we click teleport. Okay. And our interiors YouTube house. Oh dear, we try, okay. Save it in case it crashes. Here's our wondrous house that I haven't made any changes to since last time. Double click. Teleport. Alright. Now. Head back to the wasteland. Watch it crash and go to where we were before. Where did they put? There it is. Oh god. Yes, I'm taking my time navigating. Double click. Teleport. For some reason, that didn't work last time. YouTube house. The only reference in there. View linked door. There it is. And now you see this that's appeared. That's where you'll be stood when you come through. So obviously, you want it to sort of bear some kind of resemblance to the angle you came in from. I'm having trouble selecting it for some reason. My geck is... what have I done? I rotated... oh god. What? Have, how has that happened? Oh. You're going to have to bear with me while I attempt to figure out what's happening here with my house. That's better. Okay. So then you can rotate and move that like you would any other object. And now that's where you'll be stood when you come out of your house. Now view linked door. This is so annoying. Oh, yeah. Now, you can see obviously you don't want to come out inside the house. That isn't good, so that needs to be moved. Click. And have an annoying bug that not, doesn't let you move it. I've probably got that same thing I have before. No, this is going okay. Oh, bloody hell. going on. Okay. The road is back in the position it should be in. Hopefully. Is that assuming me? Oh my god. Oh well. By this stage, everybody knows that's in the game. For God's sake. Oh, why is this happening to me? What's the a problem with my mouse? Is that why is this is happening? Or is it my gek? It's completely f 
mess it up with everything I try and do. This has been the least successful tutorial in history. Fucking hell. <laughs> so, if most isn't working for me, you should pretty much know what to do from when I did it before. So I'm gonna... oh bloody hell, how has this happened again? My map... my joystick metro stations get to look a bit weird because I may have rotated all kinds of things without realising I was doing it. But I'm going to... save my mod. Oh, maybe that had something to do with it. Yes, it did. There we go. Alright, so that's it. That all saved. And I'll close my gig and have a little go at playing it. So, play, and yay! I'm going to go into data files and click YouTube house and click OK. That's how you do it on Steam anyway. I don't know actually. I'll include a Fallout mod my tutorial, probably, maybe. I'll pause it because I'm sure no one wants to watch a game load.